The Pittsburgh Steelers are closing in on a deal with safety slash linebacker Keanu Neal. So, Gary Dulac has reported that the Pittsburgh Steelers are very close to signing the safety slash linebacker Keanu Neal. And usually, when that gets released, it's just a matter of minutes or even hours until the contract officially gets done and is officially released. Usually, it's just the final wordings on the contract and it's already agreed upon that he's going to sign and now we're just waiting for it to be official. With that being said, this is the introduction to what Keanu Neal will bring to the Steelers this next season. So, as we all know, Terrell Edmonds has left the Steelers in free agency, and he was a longtime starter at strong safety. That means that now there's a gap at the starting role, and who's going to fill that? And so far, it looks like it might be Keanu Neal. Just looking at Keanu Neal, he has played seven seasons in the NFL. He's turning 28 years old in July, meaning right now he's 27, and he's played seven years. He's bringing a lot of experience. And also, his first few years in Atlanta, he was really effective. He made a Pro Bowl and also first team associated All Pro. He isn't really much of a ball lurker, but just more of a solid safety slash linebacker type of player. His first two years in Atlanta, he played really well and appeared in almost every game, but his third and fourth year in Atlanta is when he dealt with his most injuries. But ever since those injuries, he started being healthy again. So now you could really count on him to play a lot. His last year in Atlanta in 2020, he played 14 games. In 2021, when he moved on to Dallas Cowboys, he played 14 games. And just this past year, he played in every game with the Tampa Bay Buccaneers. So you could really trust on him to be available for the Steelers. Now just looking at where Keanu Neal has played. You heard me say safety slash linebacker. And that's because even though Keanu Neal started off his career as a safety, he also played everywhere with Tampa Bay and even Dallas. With Dallas, he was playing at a linebacker, middle linebacker spot a very lot. And with Tampa Bay, he was moving around the whole defense, playing free safety, strong safety, and also linebacker. And that's kind of what Terrell Edmonds does when you think about it. The Steelers' dime linebacker last season was Terrell Ed Edmonds. Meaning, when they went into a dime look, Terrell Edmonds was a Pittsburgh Steelers middle linebacker. And that's what Keanu Neal does. Keanu Neal, just looking at his statistics and where he lined up in his career, he had 233 of 580 box snaps in 2022 and 98 as a slot defender. In 2021, he played 478 snaps in the box of 579 with the Cowboys meaning that he could play everywhere on the Steelers' defense. And as we all know, Steelers love having versatile players. Players with experience, but not just experience, who could play all over the field. When you look at what Cameron Sutton did his first few years with the Steelers, he was a guy known for moving all over. When you look at Mike Hilton when he was with the Steelers, he was a guy who was moving all over, moving to the box, playing the slot, blitzing, he was doing everything. And now, them getting a guy who's developed and a guy who has experienced seven years in the NFL, and also, even though he might not be in his prime anymore, he's still such a solid guy, and the Steelers will be able to move him all around the defense. So, Gary Dulac also reported that the signing of Keanu Neal is more of a depth piece than a starter piece, meaning that the Steelers are still going to address a position in the draft. And that just doesn't take away from them selecting just say Brian Branch, for example, or even another guy later in the draft. It just doesn't take that away. Signing Keanu Neal is just a solid guy who's going to bring the depth and experience at that position. And also, when you look at Mike, what Mike Tomlin said in his press conference early in the week, he said that he was going to address the strong safety position, that he was going to add another guy in free agency or the draft. And right now, adding Keanu Neal is kind of the best case scenario. Because if they don't end up addressing another position at strong safety, he's a solid guy who is experienced in this league and a guy who Minka Fitzpatrick is going to have a good time with back in the secondary. And signing Keon Neal also allows the Steelers now to go back to the three strong safety or just safety players in general. Minka Fitzpatrick, DeMonte KZ, and also now Keon Neal. Bringing back the three safety looks could be huge for the Steelers defense and succeeding next season. So, now, Terrell Austin's going to have a great time calling defense, having more players to utilize, but let me, know, know, let me know your comments down in the comments below, how you feel about the signing, do you like the signing for the Steelers, or do you believe they could have got someone better, and do you believe that they're still going to address it in the draft? Let me know down in the comments below. And with that being said, don't forget to subscribe to the channel down below as well, 
If you like serious content, analysis, reports, like the video, turn on post notifications down below for this channel as well, so you get notified whenever I post an exterior video, click the bell down below. I've been covering all of free agency, talking about every signing we've done, and also I'm going to be covering all the draft, doing player reports, mock drafts. I already released a mock draft earlier this week, so go and check that out, and I'll see you guys all later. Like, comment, and subscribe. Till next time, I'm out. Peace.